finally have a chance to play here and represent the country, at least here in the ABL, how does it feel to finally rip the, the Philippines? Yeah, it feels great. Uh, I'm really excited for the year, um, playing for the Philippines, playing for Coach Jimmy. Um, I think it's going to be a great season for us and really excited to play in front of the fans. How did the, you ending up with Alem happen? Um, I've been trying to play with uh, the Philippines for a while now. I think um, Olive has been in contact with me for a few years. We just haven't been able to, you know, uh, get together and get, you know, work out a deal. So um, to finally get it done this year, um, I had my release papers. So um, I was able to get it all done and reached out to Charlie and um, just happy to be here. Feels like a new chapter for Alab with Regan and now you and Jeremiah joining the team. Uh, what's your ex expectations for the season now that you're playing for the Alab? Uh, yeah, I think the expectations are to win a championship. Um, they've always been a really good team in this league. Uh, I think we have high expectations. Uh, so we we'll set, set the bar really high and, and try to win a championship for the Philippines again. Uh, after last year, um, you know, them coming up short in the playoffs, I think uh, everyone has the hopes of winning a championship. What can uh, Filipino fans expect from you? Uh, you, you know, they're very critical, very, uh, very sensitive. And uh, yeah. how, how, what can they expect from from Jason? Uh, I think they can just expect me to play <laughs> uh, fast pace, uh, really push the basketball on offense, and um, you know, sharing the basketball, um, getting up and down, a lot of pick and rolls, and um, just really good basketball, team basketball, and uh, hopefully translates to winning a championship. You've been in the ABL for like three, four, four seasons already. How would that ex experience help you as well? Yeah, I think my experience of, of playing here for two years and you know winning a championship, and, and now also playing against Olive in the championship, I think that's going to help. Um, just knowing, you know, the grind of the season, you know, a lot of a lot of games and um, a lot of the teams are getting really good players, so the, the league's getting better every year. So uh, just my knowledge and experience, I think, is going to help us on the floor. And, um, to help out other guys to, to realize the, the long season and um, you know how to deal with you know adversity during the season. Um, Jason, how do you see the competition this year? See in Singapore, just got Marcus Elliott and Ubon's joined the league. Yeah, I think all the teams keep improving every year. Um, you know, adding really good imports, um, local players that are joining. So um, it's going to be really tough. I think it's going to be one of the toughest years, if not the most you know talented uh, players this year. So um, I'm excited. I'm excited for the challenge of, of playing, you know, the better teams. I think Singapore is going to be tough. Mono is going to be really good um, with their um, imports and locals. So um, I don't think it's going to be any easy games. I think every game is going to really be tough, and I think we're ready for the challenge. Jason, I know it's still too early, but uh, do you have any plans already of going to PBA? Um, I'd love to play in the PBA, but I think right now focusing on the ABL. <laughs> Uh, focusing on this season, and, and we'll see what happens after the season. But are your papers uh, okay and already? Uh, no, my papers aren't aren't finished, so uh, I'm still working on that. Uh, hope to play in the PBA one day, but uh, right now I'm just focused on Olive and, and trying to win a championship here. Thanks, Jason. Thank